Tony, you up? Oh, Kenneth's on his way over from uh, Perry. We're going to camp on his bar tonight. Well, it's going to be a good bar to do it on. Everything's down. I was going to go play up north of uh, Mount Vernon on the river and check out some bars and then uh, make my way down there. But, uh, Uh, that's on Tony Zorn on the radio. As I was getting ready to take off, he was coming over to the airport and his airplane headed to the river. So I think I'm going to go uh, fly the river him for, for a few minutes, work back down, and land. That was fun flying. It's always the adventures that you don't plan that just spontaneously happen that are the best. I was getting in the airplane and Vidalia, Tony Zorn was flying over. So hooked up with him at the river and we just went flying the river and he was showing me a lot of the bars he likes to land. And <laughs> oh man, it was too much fun, too much fun. He uh, actually stopped at a sandbar just north of here and got out to relax for a second. I come on down to where we're gonna camp at and uh, Glenn is on the river in the boat. Yeah, so I'm just gonna hang out here and wait for Tony, Glenn, and Kenneth to get here. <laughs> this is gonna be a good time. is the Super Stowell, and uh, that, that was too cool. That's an insane aircraft, but uh, the sun is set, the winds are died down, so me and Kenneth is gonna take off and do a little uh, river flight. Man, just enjoying a, a day in aviation. coming from the south. Yeah, that one's nice. That's the one I've landed for. All right, I got one of you. I'm off to the left wing. Oh, I see you up there. Oh, it was too cool. Two There's people on the bar, a couple bars up on the right. Yeah, neighbor. Yeah, the way y'all are headed. I'm hiding off your right wing, Brian. Gotcha.
Brian, do you like flying this one better than the Automaha? Uh, I like the, uh, yeah, you got to be a, awake a little more, but I do like the comfort that the Automaha gives you, how wide it is. Oh, yeah, for sure. Less people normally here. Yeah. This one here that I just passed, it's landable. Shorter, but it's landable. Tony's probably got a name for all of them. Yeah, probably so. You know you're special when you have a bar named after you. Yeah, Chris, do you have a Chris's bar yet? Tony doesn't clean the ball. I mean, I got a Kenneth's bar. There's no Brian's bar. Oh, no, I don't have anything like that. Yeah, well, you guys know who I supposed to sleep with who to make that happen? I mean, I'm family and didn't get one. We're going to reach that legend status one day. All right, I'm coming out of the river, just past the camping site, circling back to the left. I'm down to stop and clear. I got you in sight, Chris. All right. Good seeing you, Chris. All right, you guys have a good one. She wrote. <laughs> you just hang on for the ride at that point. <laughs> That's all I was doing. <laughs> oh man, that was awesome. We uh we had three planes deep just ripping, roaring down through the Oconee River. Uh, out in this part, it's so far from the boat landings, there's nobody really out, so it's it's just a good wide open playground. It was uh it was absolutely phenomenal. Um God, this is what I signed up for. Man, but uh, hey, the sun's going down. It's time to get serious about catching fish now. See. Fish on. I think, I think it's a little one. I think it's still on there. Got him. That's a good one if you're starving to death. Here's here's your angle for him. Yeah, get him real close. Nice. I finally caught a fish. She's a monster. <laughs> Find out real quick. So obviously when you go camping with Glenn, he doesn't hold short. <laughs> he brings a grill, pork chops. I did contribute and bring some sausages I got from Walmart. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You oh, oh. He did a somersault to get that thing. <laughs> Hold him up. That's a big one. <laughs> Hold him up. I can't. He's too heavy. He's too heavy. Put him real close. Yeah, if you hold him real close. Oh, he's a giant. <laughs> Kinda. <laughs> we just dropped the eight feet deep. Oh, <laughs> and be careful, please. I got you. Ooh, slippery. Get out of sight. Don't go too far back. Or up. Just sit down right there. I hope there ain't no alligator right here. It probably is. He can get Good? Yeah. You made a ride to the sandbar? I'd appreciate it. 
know, you didn't have nothing else to do. Gotta get this fire going. We, we were sitting around the campfire last night and um, I heard something splash and I thought what was that went over to check on my fishing poles I had apparently caught a fish and it was big enough that it pulled the rod out of the rod holder and you could see the track through the sandbar where it run off with it so I come with two rods I'm only going home with one rod so part of the adventure. All right, here we go. Man, this was an incredible adventure. That was so much fun. So much fun. But I'm gonna take off and head back to Vidalia and get cleaned up and I'm ready to go home and see my wife and kids.